beauties and welcome to vlogtober day 10 um i you can see my pink hair a little bit more now that i've got it up i think we shall see once i actually put it in the computer but it's not as pink as i had it last time um because obviously the pink toner build up had like gone because i'd obviously been washing it and it was a couple extra weeks but that's rosie it's because you can hear me talking um That's Rosie. Rosie parking because I'm up here. But today is World Mental Health Day. So I've just been taking some pictures for my Instagram posts and blog posts that's going to go up today um, about the Anti Burnout Clubs app. Um, let me get it up. If I can, I'll pop a little picture in the screen. But they kindly gave me a three month subscription to the oh actually it'll still be in my web browser yeah so they kind of gave me a three month subscription to their service and then they offered to send a little box of goodies um like to take pictures with but the goodies didn't arrive so i just basically took pictures of the um app on my phone my words today just escaped me i took pictures of the app on my phone like all set up pretty with a hot drink and my like um gratitude journal um but it's really really nice the app because you can go in and select like when you sign up you can select like your goals that you want to achieve um and they've got quite a long list there's everything from like eating better sleeping better get moving more being less anxious less stressed there's loads of them and then when you first like kind of sign up it has like the dashboard hold on let me let me turn my screen brightness down and see if that helps you, you can kind of see it's a bit glitchy um it's like reflecting weirdly off the screen but it gives you kind of like three spotlight goals and then it gives you like a lesson of the day they have live lessons every day so like today's live lesson was yoga at 9 a.m with becky and the lesson of the day is cbt to help improve meditation you can then sign up to like a bunch of classes so there's like goal setting five foundations of wellness um a bloating series the basics of breathing for like meditation and yoga there's a pilates one there's a sleep one which i'm going to sign up for um how to relax summer of self-confidence and then it also has the classes and recipes so i love because i am so bad for picking recipes and i will eat the same five recipes and get sick um of them so it gives you loads of different ones and it gives you loads of different classes so there's like cbt the rain technique for anxiety um stratosphere stratology i don't really know how you pronounce that um there's like loads of different classes and manager managing your expectations and you can basically say oh sorry <laughs> i'm just trying baked salmon with courgette and quinoa so they have loads of different like really nice healthy recipes um so you can literally click whatever you fancy and once you click on to like the course that you want to do so if i go to a sleep one there's a sleep one um so you can go on and actually sign up and it tells you about what you're kind of going to learn in it so it's really really interesting so i took a couple of pictures and i'm gonna go downstairs and write the blog post all about it um and then i need to edit yesterday's vlog and day seven and eight into one as well um i'm so sleepy today <sighs> i need an extra strong coffee i just can't wake up you know when you get that like heavy eyelids feeling like i could literally just close my eyes and fall asleep again that's why they look oh, God, they look so haggard they look so dark <laughs> i look awful today I need to go back to sleep for another like three hours. Let's, yeah, maybe take myself out of the darkness a little bit. They don't look as bad. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try and get a bunch of work done today. Hopefully, I'm hoping I can go back to work next week. Um, it's still... I saw the occupational health physio from work two weeks ago. And even with the exercises she's given me, it's no better two weeks in. Um, I'm, I've got to ring the musculoskeletal team tomorrow. And hopefully have an in-person appointment um they said to ring if i hadn't heard anything by the 11th so unless they're gonna ring me tomorrow i don't know um but it just doesn't seem i can hold the camera but when i try and do anything with it now it just hurts 
I would love to have a body that just functioned. And that'd just be bliss. Um, so I'm going to drink my like giant cup of coffee. It's like the size of my head. And then I'm going to get some stuff done. But before I go downstairs and get stuff done on my laptop, I'm going to show you a package that come from Dermalogica, which I don't think I've shown. And um, my older hey PJs that I got because they're really, really cute this year. Um, and if you're interested in the older hey pajamas, when I went online to the Matlam website, they were out of stock like they weren't even showing it out of stock but when I went into my, my local land which was the rock retail park they had a bunch right as you walk in the door it's all there and they had like a bunch of the adults and um, quite a few kids they didn't have any of the dog ones um they had like one random one that must have been a return because it was just plopped on um and luckily it was the right size for Rosie so we picked it up so she's got one as well um but I will show you the, the I think I don't know if they're like UK wide in the stores. I know they're in like the stores on the Wirral and like Liverpool because obviously it's all the hay. Um, but I don't know about the rest of the world, well, the rest of the country. But I'll get them out of the bag and show you guys. Right, so these are the older hay pajamas. They're so cute. It's got have a jolly Ollie, which is I believe the elephant. This whole thing, uh, Christmas, and it's just got the little elephant on and then Christmas trees. I you have to buy these like in like september october time because if you try and get them close to christmas they're never in stock so i know they're christmas pjs but they're gonna stay wrapped up and i'm not gonna wear them yet and then i also wanted like baggy oversized tops for the gym because i don't really like like i don't mind gym leggings but i don't like anything too like fitted on the top because one i have big boobs so it just looks I look and feel uncomfortable if it draws too much attention to my boobs um so I wanted some nice big baggy tops so these were like six pound each so I found one this one's all right it's just like a, a bike one and then then this one will do they had like weird phrases and things on so these were like the least two weird ones that I could find from the men's section um so I thought they'll just do and then the lovely folks at Dermalogica kindly sent me their iconic daily microfoliant so they sent me a top up and then now from the Dermalogica website instead of buying a new bottle every single time you buy them you can actually just keep your bottle and refill it by taking so I don't know if you'll be able to see it but this top bit here before the little like bit that you screw the cap onto this bit pops off and then you can literally take out the little like is it mica packet you know the little like packet to stop things going like bad inside you take that out and then the rest of it just gets poured in and it literally it was just like 90 odd yep it's 92 percent less plastic i don't know if it's gonna show on the little green bit yeah. So on the little blue bit there, it says that there's 92 less plastic if you use the refills. Um, so that is great. So I'm going to pop that in some Instagram content as well. But, oh God, I am going to get some work done. Get this blog post written, finish my coffee and get this vlog edited. I need to make a list of my content. Ooh, there you go. I need to make a list of my content for this next week. Um, so that tomorrow I can take some pictures and things. I was going to go to the body shop Arndale invited me along to their new like reopening. They must have redone their store. Um, so they were doing a bloggers event to reopen. But, I don't know. It's four to seven. They have invited me. I haven't bought tickets yet because obviously I didn't know what was going on. Um, so I haven't fully committed to it yet. I'd love to go but I just don't. I feel like I've done too much. Anyone with like fibromyalgia will know. I've got this like feeling of dread in me because I feel like I did too much last week and I'm just waiting for a flare up to happen. Um, so I think I'm gonna, especially if I'm going back to work, I think I'm just gonna say thank you for the invite but could I come in a different day to check it out? Um, Cause I'm worried about doing it and then going to work and then having a flare up and ending off sick again. And <sighs> my sickness and like, anxiety levels are so high at the minute um and it's just making it worse so i think i'm gonna say no and then ask to come in a different day and i'll do it when i've got like a couple of days off and i can just have a nice like day because it's a good hour on the train from where i am at least but anyway i'm gonna stop waffling and get some work done
absolutely shattered now i have got my editing done i've made basically a little bit of a plan um and i kind of sorted out all my like blogger mail pr mail that's due to be like kind of featured um because i kind of sort it all out and i don't have it in with my usual collection just so i know what's been photographed and what hasn't um so i've sorted that out a bit more so it looks a bit less crazy <laughs> um but i'm gonna leave it here for tonight because i am still very sleepy i put a bit of makeup on to try and hide how wretched i felt um but you can still see the bags coming through so i'm gonna leave it here for tonight and i will see you guys tomorrow bye guys mm -hmm.